Right now, the focus is on protecting our healthcare workers. James Morin is the chief operating officer of Flowfold, a 10-year-old small business in Gorm that makes bags and wallets with sustainable materials like recycled sailcloths. All of that is on hold. Eight days ago, we sent an email to Maine Health Partners and said, what do you need? They told us, and we picked what we could make. So they're now making plastic face shields for doctors, nurses, and hospital workers. They wear this over their mask to protect the other vital portions of their face. Flowfold had to source new materials like plastic and foam, but their eight full-time workers use their sewing skills and cutting machines to assemble the shields. In their first week, they've delivered 1,000 to Maine Health Partners. We're prepared to ramp up to basically make, make as many as we need. That's the goal. Boosting medical worker supplies is also the goal of family-owned Bedard Pharmacy here in Auburn. It's asking anyone who happens to possess medically acceptable masks, from construction workers to tattoo artists, to turn them in. In exchange, the pharmacy, which has a drive through window, will give donors cloth masks. It is commissioned from a factory in Lewiston. The cloth mask that we are offering is machine washable. It's 100% cotton. And for the average person walking around, you should be fine. And we'll have uh, a lot more on Friday for you. Perfect. Today, Pharmacy Business Development Director Ben Natto picked up his first batch of hand-stitched cloth masks. Help protect our patients, help protect our frontline healthcare workers. That's all that matters in this right now. And that's the spirit that motivates James Morin and his partners at Flowfold. That so many people can rally behind a cause that is bigger than their own. Without a second thought, we said, okay, no more wallets, we're making face shields, let's get behind this. Phil Hirschkorn, WMTW News 8, Gorham.